Was it intentional to miss the first shot? Were you aiming for the end boards? No, I, I wish. Uh, yeah, it's kind of rolled on me, shoveled it wide, and I was just happy it bounced back to me. So. So what made you though think to do that move? Was it the angle? Like, was that the only shot you had? No, I couldn't tell you. It just kind of instincts took over, I guess. But I think it uh, probably would have been a little easier to shoot it in on my forehand. But whatever counts. Where does that goal ring for you in terms of the creativeness, the slickest? Oh, I don't know. Uh, it's probably up there. It's pretty high, but um, yeah, just kind of one of those fluky ones that just kind of happens natural. Just in, in terms of the timing of the goal, I don't know, you felt lucky getting out of the second period, maybe up one nothing, but to get it early in the third and just kind of stem any hopes of that, that comeback for them, just how big was that? Yeah, Talb's uh, helped us out a lot tonight. I think definitely that second period he played unreal and Getting that one for him just to, to give him some confidence back there was huge for us. And obviously we wanted to have a better uh, third than second. So it's, uh, it was nice to get that, but kind of starts with everyone out there. Benny with a really good breakout play and kind of stems from that. So How nice was it to get him the shutout? It seems like so many times this year he's been on the verge of getting one, but to actually you know, get a goose egg. Yeah, it's awesome. I think uh, everyone's really happy for him. He's playing unbelievable recently. and. It's great for him to get the shutout. Obviously, whenever that happens, you're gonna get a lot of confidence from it, but uh, when he's only given up one goal, is uh, giving us a chance to win no matter what, so he's uh, he's been awesome. What's just the vibe right now? The playoffs are clinched, but obviously there's still games left to play and seeding left to finalize. Do you still sense this is a very motivated group, Matt? Yeah, for sure. We wanna win every night, I think. Come to the rink, that's the intention, and it's trying to play our best hockey going into playoffs and get those kind of kinks out of our game where we can go into playoffs kind of rolling and playing our best hockey. As the team tries to kind of get healthy here, and you're playing three games and four nights, it seems like all the time right now. I mean, is this just the kind of wins that you have to kind of grind through sometimes against teams that aren't going to be in the playoffs in a couple weeks? Yeah, for sure. I mean, that's still a really good hockey team where they're, uh, they gave us a really good game. They play really hard. They unbelievable goalie back there and stuff like that so no no game's going to be easy you got to show up and you got to play hard and yeah it's they haven't been the prettiest I'd say recently but you're getting the two points and that's what matters. This is a lot of hockey for you Matt how have you just dealt with the NHL workload and you know trying to stay at your best now at the most important juncture? Yeah, it's having fun with it I think is uh, the biggest thing for me. Um, the more fun you're having, the more easy it comes and the more excited you are to play and stuff like that. If you show up with a bad attitude and, and stuff like that, it's just going to make you more tired and not as motivated. So just having fun and I think our locker room makes it pretty easy with the guys we have in there and the, and the characters. So. And the line you're on too, I'm sure that. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, nothing but praise for them as, as it's been. They've been unbelievable. They make it really easy. Just to go back to the goalies, how much confidence do you guys have? You know, knowing that whoever is on the ice, it'll be a brick wall in front of you guys. Yeah, it's awesome. I think uh, playing in front of them is a blast, knowing that they have your back, and obviously we try to help them as much as we can, but we got all the confidence in the world in both those guys back there, and like you said, it's it's a wall back there, and they're, they're both playing really well right now.